Got big ears, yeah. That's you know what sure. say about big ears. Okay, a lot of ear wax. You gotta get big, big headphones. Oh. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yo, uh, you know what they say about getting a date in the Dodger Stadium, right? <laughs> what did what they say, bro? What did they say, bro? You're gonna get caught. Yeah, uh, yeah, you will. It's, it's closed, <laughs> and when there's just random people in there, you want to figure out what's going on with security and shit. Who the fuck and, is that? Yeah, Drake. Uh, Who the fuck would it? It's Drake ended up getting tactic. caught by by some drone or something. Uh, it, he had a private date with uh, a young fella's mom, a young basketball player's mom. Drake ended up meeting her at LeBron's uh, coaching thing at LeBron's coaching game. And was it his coaching game or was it Bronny's game? And he was just there. Doesn't LeBron coach for for Bronny? No, no. He's just what, a dad, bro. Oh, so he's just attending yeah, the game. Canyon, right? Yeah, he's huh? just attending the game. Yeah. yeah. Well, well, because well, the number one draft pick is gonna it was there. I think yeah. Mari Bailey. I think is his name. Ah, uh, okay. So that's his mom. LeBron, yeah, LeBron's son's in there, and Drake was supporting LeBron's son. Same thing with Michael B. Jordan. Ended up finding that chick. Chick looks fine as can be. And uh yeah, now they have a date in the Dodger Stadium. I I told I told Ozzy, why the fuck they can't make this in the Clipper Stadium? And he says, What if they already have? No, I did not say that. Oh, I said, what if I said what if Drake already done that with somebody else? Oh, oh, okay, okay, okay. You know Which, I mean, yeah, absolutely. A lot of Man, what if her favorite that. team, the Dodgers, you know what I'm saying? Like, what if it's always been a dream of hers to eat at Dodger Stadium? Or maybe she's done that with some other nigga before. Who the fuck knows? True. What if she was like, hey, I got the spot we can go to just so they yeah. can get caught. Now she got I, yeah, caught. I, I, was, I was fucking the chef, and he has good food. Oh, you're talking about her. I, I, was know. Like, what? I know. I was like, why would Drake say that? <laughs> hey, it's 2021, you know, and they might be gay. <laughs> nah, yeah. I mean, the chef could be a woman, too. Yeah. A chef can be a woman. I got a woman chef. My chef's a woman. My chef acted like a woman. Fuck you. Shout out to our chef. Talk about man. him like that. <laughs> Alex was the chef at my job. <laughs> If, if y'all become successful, would y'all get y'all personal chef? Fuck no. I'd take up cooking. <laughs> I'd learn to cook a lot of shit, honestly. I'd cook, bro. What the fuck? You're cooking yeah. the rest of your life? Why the fuck not? That's what I do yeah. anyway. I, <coughs> do you find it fun? Chris? Me? Cooking? Yeah. yeah. No? Do you hate it? Is it a task? It's a task. It's a That's time why you would be the chef. Yeah. You, got, time you gotta learn to like it. A time killer to fucking to survive, bro? <laughs> what the yeah. fuck? You gotta feed yourself, bro. I know oh, how to damn. feed myself, but if I was in the future. <laughs> yeah, but what what happens when McDonald's somebody real quick, up, bro? You get get that like holographic shit and eat it. Home. <laughs> <laughs> Nah, uh, Home. I feel eventually. Like, like I know how, I, I I like how to I like how to cook certain certain shit. Do you? But, are you saying you don't know how to cook? That's why you don't like to cook. No, I. I if you don't know how to cook. Just it's say time that. Time consuming. It is time consuming for me. And if you don't know how to cook, just say that. Because you can cook like this, bro. You can cook stuff real fast. You're probably associating it with like cooking when you're hungry. It kind of sucks when you're cooking when you're hungry because you're just like fuck. I want to eat it so, so fast. So like, so it. like with with chicken, I gotta with chicken. I gotta take it out the wrapper. I gotta get vinegar. Gotta get some lime. I gotta like wash the chicken really good. That's what does that do for you though? It takes time. But what does that do? It cleans the what chicken. What is what? What is what? It cleans the chicken. And then what do you do with when you clean the chicken inside the sink? Yeah. Right? You say so you, you put clean in the water. The sink. You so gotta... look, okay, check it out. So when you put the water on the chicken, when you clean the chicken, uh-huh. you know, water splatters, right? So you're actually spreading more bacteria than right. what you what you're trying to clean up. Uh the chicken already comes clean, so you're actually just you're taking a step because you want to take a step. 
it, it all that slime is clean. Yeah, it's blood. Okay, well, I mean, I I rather not have it. That's, <laughs> that, that's y'all. Y'all, y'all got having slimy and everything, but no, I'm saying you're putting more bacteria in your chicken anyway. No, you clean how, it. how clean, you clean, how it clean is your tap water? How clean is your tap water? That that is another thing. I rather well, I rather trust. You pour a water bottle on top of it. I rather, <laughs> I, I rather trust that that would get rid of the bacteria a lot quicker than all the slime and and getting veins and shit that it has on there. That all well, the preservatives clean, are going to be cleaning the chicken, like cutting the chicken and washing the chicken is so totally, totally different. So I can, you can cut off the veins, you can mm. cut off the spine, you can cut off the excess fat on the chicken. That's cleaning the chicken. If you're right. washing chicken, it literally makes no difference. Because you have bacteria everywhere, bro. So you're literally just taking... But no, I'm, I'm trying to help you out. No, no, no. I, I know it's time consuming. It's time consuming because you're taking an extra step. It, it is. It's very time consuming. So I'd rather just hire somebody. If, you, if, you, if you're if you out there cutting a fuck, If you go cut a chicken open, nigga, and you take their breast out, all right, fine. Wash the blood off. Clean it the fuck up. But if you're buying it from a store... It's clean, my nigga. I don't trust it. <laughs> you don't trust. You don't trust what? I don't trust the slime and shit. All the preservatives that that, that they use to you're to eating it anyway. No, but you could clean it off. The same thing with like a fruit. Like if you if you take a, a an apple from the fruit aisle and and boil it, you're gonna see all like a wax come off of the of the fruit. And that's all the preservatives that they spray it with, so it could last longer. And I'm not saying I'm 100 percent so, right. So you boil your apples before you eat them? No. I clean it really well, but with what? The water. <laughs> with what water? The tap oh, water? Oh my gosh! Yeah. Or purified with, water? With tap water. Oh my gosh! So cold or hot? I mean, cold. I don't want to ruin the apple, so I, I do it cold. You do it cold, probably, right? Because that makes right. more sense, right? So you, aren't you actually just coating the fucking apple in tap water? You're taking you the preservatives really out of it. The preservatives that are inside of the apple already because no, that stuff is on, is on the skin. It's on the skin of the apple. So no, because the skin's I, I, there. I'll send you a video. I'll send you a video. But, but no, I'm saying, but if the skin's there, that means nothing can get inside of it, right? You're eating so the skin. Every, everything that they spray, but you don't think it goes inside of the apple or inside the core? I mean, it's better than doing nothing at all and just eating the whole thing. Is it? Because you're yeah. eating the whole thing anyway. No, <laughs> you, I'm cleaning it. Apples? I'm cleaning it. The, the, I mean, I, I get I get what you're saying. It's never going to be completely clean, but that's like saying... You I'm, clean I'm, it with I'm, dirty tap water from Lehigh Acres, Florida. Right. <clears throat> so it's either I take the chance of tap water or I take the chance of preservatives. I'll I'll wipe off the, the tap water and and take that chance. Throw it in the dishwasher. Fuck it. <laughs> I, I get what you mean. I get eating, what you mean. You're I'm eating just... double. You're eating double shit because <laughs> the preservatives <laughs> are in the apple, and you're adding more minerals and debris to your apple for putting the water on it. But who's to say they didn't water it already? Ooh. Ooh. Now who's to say they didn't water it while, while it was in the store? Maybe they did. What if they're throwing, what if it's not water? What if it's preservatives? I, I don't know. Nobody knows. It, it is an interesting conversation. Because, I mean, no, maybe I am, like, wasting time for no reason. And <laughs> Definitely. Over, most definitely. I'm an overthinker. I mean, yeah. we, we, we say this almost every every episode. Think I it over, bro. You know? Think it over. I'm just really fucking blazed. So. Uh, I'll keep going. No, no, no.